okay, I just, just now, got done watching a movie called Mary and Max, and I felt extremely compelled and inclined to come on here directly after having seen the movie to rave about it and to <clears throat> and to tell you that you need to drop what you're doing and see this movie. I don't say that very often about movies because I am sort of a movie snob and I am probably overly critical of films, usually, uh, typically, I guess, but this film is fantastic. It is great. Uh, <laughs> it's very well done. I don't know what else to say about it. I, I, I could go on a long time about <clears throat> about how good this film was and how much I actually enjoyed the the process of watching it. And that's the thing about this movie. Sometimes sometimes movies are really bad and I enjoy watching them. Sometimes movies I know are really good and sometimes I don't particularly enjoy the actual process of watching a movie. But this is or was one of the, the rare instances when I think that the film was structurally and technically as fantastic as the actual act of watching the film was enjoyable. I'm not going to say what it's about. Uh, it's animated. It's like claymation. But don't let that fool you. I'm giving the film four and a half stars <clears throat> out of five. I am slightly reserved about giving it five because I don't really give fives to films except for a few very, very, very rare instances, uh, including films that are basically my favorite films of all time. And so there's a very small list of, of films that I actually deem to be perfect. And this wasn't a perfect film, but it was one of the best ones that I've seen in a little while. And as you know, I watch films every day, so, well, you might not know that, but now you do. And so I watch films every day, and so I watch a lot of them, and this is the best one that I've seen in a while. Uh, I'm lost for words because I'm shocked at how good the movie was, and I want to make sure that I articulate uh, my feelings adequately, and I think that by my lack of articulation, perhaps that's more uh, demonstrative of my feelings towards the films, towards the film, than actually just, uh, I don't know, explicating a well thought out uh, analysis or something like that. So, watch the movie. You, you might be thinking of like Tim Burton with his claymation stuff or, uh, you know, all this other nonsense, but this blows away, blows away anything uh, that you probably would have seen before. I don't know what else to say, so I'm just going to get excited and uh, tell you to watch the movie, force you to watch the movie. I'm going to make you watch it. Uh, I don't know how, but I'm going to somehow. But watch the movie and uh, let me know what you think if you do end up watching it.